For centuries, the winds of the Indian Ocean have brought explorers and merchants to the island of Zanzibar. Through rough seas and monsoon weather, one ship has sustained trade and travel, the Dhow. At 150 feet, this is the biggest Dhow constructed on Zanzibar for some time. The Somali merchant who commissioned it has waited four long years to see it finished. Built without plans or power tools, even the wooden hull is fastened together using the hard air roots of mangrove trees instead of nails. But the final product is a sailing ship tough enough to withstand the power of the Indian Ocean and the force of monsoon winds. For as long as anyone can remember, constant winds have buffeted the Swahili coast. The predictability of these winds made international trade possible, but it was the ingenuity of the Dow's design that made it practical. There are dozens of different kinds of Dow from every country bordering the Indian Ocean, but they all share one common feature, their sail. Traditional European ships depended on having the wind behind them, but the Dow's adjustable sail could be turned to catch the wind in any direction. Swahili sailors love the chance to display their skills. Dow races are the perfect opportunity. For the sailors of Zanzibar, these age-old ships continue to be at the heart of a rich maritime tradition. <laughs> 